So with a few Crash Bandicoot videos on the channel, I wanted to tackle another game I played as a kid. That's Spyro the Dragon. The game released way back in 1998 on the original PlayStation, developed by Insomniac. That name might sound familiar, they're the talented bunch that made the Ratchet and Clank series, the Resistance series, and more recently, the Spider-Man games. For those who don't know what Spyro is, it's a platformer where we play as Spyro, a little purple dragon, gliding, breathing fire and charging into enemies, while collecting gems and saving his friends from the evil nasty Nork. Since we're going for the Platinum, we obviously aren't going to be playing the original, so that's where the Spyro Reignited Trilogy comes in. An updated PS4 version with amazing graphics and of course, trophies. So, how do we earn 100% completion and all 37 of its trophies? Well, we'll have to 100% every level, including all of the home worlds. That's 12,000 gems, rescuing all 80 dragons, and grabbing all 12 dragon eggs. Doing all that will unlock the final secret level, and there's also a few fun trophies along the way, but we'll discuss that later. And the adventure begins. So you might have noticed under my camera there, I have already got six of the 37 trophies. I played it back when it came out. Whatever reason though, I just never really got many of the, the trophies. So like Crash, this is a game I played when I was much younger and uh, really enjoyed it. I remember it not being that difficult though, like especially compared to Crash. Okay, so Spyro can't swim. Noted. Spyro looks like he's absolutely loving life right there, doesn't he? <laughs> right, here we are. We're in the town square. Here we can glide over there with the bulls. And get more gems first. Right, to take out the bulls, we need to, like, ram them and then flame them. It's an interesting looking... Uh... Oh, i got to, like, ram it and then jump and catch it. Okay. So we got some stuff up there as well. I don't know if I can reach that right now. Maybe I can jump from up on that ledge. What's that sound? Someone's going like, nah, 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 nah. Oh, it's that guy up there. Look, see him? Oh, what's his issue? Wait until I get up there. And he's stolen a dragon egg. You've got to Someone stole a dragon egg. Get that egg. Run, run. Is that the dude that was going like nee, 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 a second ago? What are you cooking, bro? Can I have some? No? Okay, bye. All right, we need to figure out how to get up on these higher platforms. All right, so we got the portal there to return home as well. Uh, so I think if I run and jump from here. Yeah, there we go. I can make it round. Now I can get this little turd who's taunting me. Where are you going, bro? I mean, he's leading me to all the gems, so, you know, I'll take it. Oof, almost ran off the edge. Right, i got to be careful now with these jumps. Don't want to mess him up. I hear him, I just don't see him. Where is it? Oh, he's gone down there. Yeah, he does have the egg. Hey, you. Give me the... Did we get him? Oh, I got him. There's the egg. Wait, so what do we do with the egg? Do I have to take it back to to that other guy that we were just speaking to? Oh, I got blame that. Nice. Okay. Oh, nice. We got 200 out of 200. Right, so we've got all of the gems in this area now, so I'm, I'm assuming we can move on to the next level. Yeah, so she's telling me about that. All dragons found as well. Nice. 100% level complete, so it also tells you that, which is pretty nice. Right, who's this guy? If you prove your worth Marco the Balloonist. Ten dragon, Rescued 10 dragons. To fly to a new world. Oh, okay. So rescue 10, and then we can go to a new, Come totally new to area. All right, got you. So this is just world one. All right, well, let's keep completing uh, more levels then, I guess. I'm loving this so far. So much fun, man. So much fun. Let's go to Stone Hill. Take everything out. All right, this is a decent sized area, so I think I'll work my way around clockwise. Go through here first. We got another dragon. And a hell of a lot of uh, chests. Gems for days. You love to see it. I'll take them all, mate. On one of their platforms, you're saving your progress. That oh, okay, I didn't know that. If you run into trouble, 
Not that you ever run into trouble, Spyro. Sweet. So yeah, they're kind of like a save, like a chat point. But first, let me tell you a story. No thanks. See ya. <laughs> Damn, Spyro, you you're a savage, bro. Absolute mad lad. You ain't got time for story. He's basically like the kids' version of the Doom Slayer. <laughs> He's like, I don't care about no story dialogue. Nah, brother, not for me, mate. Oh my god, we got another one of those things taunting us, bro. Where you are, you little shit? Oh, he's around there somewhere. Oh, chill, chill, chill. Get out my way, bro. The wizard? Are you a good guy or a bad guy? All right, well, there's my answer. What are you laughing at, bro? Everyone's just super cocky in this game, including Spyro. <laughs> bro, there's loads of them. Twins. That was a triple kill, mate. <laughs> Can I jump over there? I mean... We can obviously jump onto that platform there because it's got gems. I'm not sure. Fail. Right, so we can go over here. There's loads of stuff. What do we do with these? Oh, it's like a it's a barrier. Okay, so we don't do anything with those. It's just a you ain't going past this way deal. Okay, well, we can explore the available areas and grab any chests and. <gasps> there he is. Look, where are you going? Wait, stop running, you little pube. Come here. Gotcha, you little turd. Give me my egg, bro. Thank you. Oh, trophy. My first official trophy. Sheep kebab. Blame 10 sheep in Stone Hill. Okay. <laughs> nice. Well, there's my first proper trophy. We are down here. We gotta be careful. Cause... Oh, there's no water down here. Okay. In we go. I might be the final dragon. Gavin. Here we go. All dragons. Wait, what? Oh, I didn't want to do that. Oh, wait, the chest, mate. Right, can I go back down there, please? Thank you. Right, yeah, so we got all the dragons. Now I just need to find the remaining. Wait, how do I get in there, bro? It's locked. Oh, there's a little beach down here. Oh, nope. didn't notice this before. A little beach with some extra gems. Oh, and a cave as well. Oh, a key. Okay. That's probably... For the, that chest that I was trying to open a moment ago, uh, in the well. I was trying to ram it and use fire and stuff, and none of it worked, so this key must be what we need. And then potentially we could get 100%. Right, so now we know if we can see them chests, we need to find a key in the area. There we go. Nice, 200. 100% level completion. Beautiful. That's Stonehill done. Oh. Then we got 100 out of 100 of them. And then I'd imagine this is probably the last dragon as well for, cool. for this like open world area. All dragons found nice. Yeah, so we're probably 100% complete. Yeah, so that's the open world area. And we can take on Toasty, this world's boss. We'll leave him for now because I'm pretty sure we've got another two or three levels that we need to do in this area. We'll tackle the boss last. Got another level. Dark Hollow. All right, here we go. Get out of my way, bro. These dudes have got shields. We still burn them, though. And we can burn the frogs. Kind of feel tight doing that, but, you know. Right, so, yeah, now we know this requires a key, so we're going to have to find another key somewhere in this. You're a big fella, aren't you? Jeez. You got a key? Oh, okay. Well, he was huge, but he still went down with no effort. Gems. There's the key as well for this level. I mean, there could be more than one lock chest, obviously, but... I've only seen one, so now we got the key. We can head back up here and open it. Right, here we go. Open this puppy up. Sweet. Oh, a little bonfire. Oh, trophy. Light my fire. Light the two bonfires in Dark Hollow. Oh, sweet. I didn't even, I didn't even know where the second... Oh, the other one was there. I didn't even realize I lit that one. Sweet. I was just thinking of Dark Souls, but beautiful. Rescued like Darius. The... All dragons found is the exit, so hopefully these are the remaining ones we need for the gems as well. Oh, 99. I'm missing one gem. There it is. Gotcha. Alright, 100% complete. Alright, well, I'm not 100% sure if I've done all the levels. I've done three. Can't seem to find another one, so I'm going to assume I've done them. We're going to head into Toasty and take on the boss. Oh, so... Rude. So... I just kind of assumed going into the boss room means it's just going to be a boss, but it seems like it's also its own level. Oh, you got to hit the dogs twice. Oh, that one just fell off the map. Use that toaster, the scarecrow. Are you, are you toaster? 
Wait, is it a sheep inside a scarecrow outfit? I could have swore I just saw a, a little sheep or something inside. <laughs> Get out of my way. And you, you little turd. Oh, trophy. Burnt toast. <laughs> Defeat Toasty without getting hit by him. Oh, hell yeah. Level complete as well. Should be 100% when I open these two. Right, we're missing 11 more gems. Should be the remaining gems. There we go. Beautiful. 100% complete. All right, so I think I've done all of the levels in this area. We just beat the boss and we've saved how many? 16 dragons. We needed 10 to get to the next area. So let's go to Balloon Boy and see where he takes us. Peacekeeper's world. Yeah, take me to the peacekeeper's world, bro. I'll just jump on his head. <laughs> okay. I never expected to see a dragon traveling by in a hot air balloon. I just assumed dragons can just fly you know but my dragon he can only glide all right we are we're in world two. Oh jesus the firing cannons at me bro chill calm down bro can i fire the cannon oh i can can i turn it you got rabbits in this one bro you need to chill with those cannons fellas like you're gonna hurt yourself bro get out of here what's this dry canyon all right we're going in it worked I wonder if I can make that. That's a long glide. Oh, I'm gonna have to come back over here anyway when I get the key. There's the key. Oh, missed. Boo. Gotta go all the way back around now. Where do we go from here? Oh, hell yeah. That's how you get to this platform. You don't even go that way. I won't even go in the right way. All right, there's the key and the final dragon. All right, so now I just need the chest. Ooh, I almost didn't make that. All right, so hopefully, grab this. That'd be 100%. Yep, there we go. 100% level completion. Firework. Oh, I bet that will hit that over there, actually. Nice. Get out of my way, brother. Bugger up. You want some as well? Birds of a feather. Blame every vulture in Cliff Town. Alright, I'm not even gonna lie. I was searching for probably like 15 minutes. Couldn't find them. So I thought I'd have a look online. Guess where they are? They're over there, look. That is such a sneaky little spot. This should be the final few that I need. There we go. Alright, now we're 100% done with this area. Yeah, that was a that was a very well hidden little area. Trophy. Triathlon. Defeat all three ski knots. Beautiful. Oh, he kind of run. Burn his ass. <laughs> Off he goes. Right, so we're going to have to do that a couple of times. Oh, this time he spins when he attacks, maybe when he does that. I can burn him. Yeah, there we go. One more hit, I would imagine, because the home thing's there. Let's see what he does this time wide spin this time but still a spin now go over spin all right got it quick as soon as it misses there we go nice and there's the lock chest which will probably give me 100 percent in this area and for this boss nice yep 100 percent complete so that's dr shemp all right we go night flight oh this is a bit different Flying level. Okay, so I got them. I'm supposed to flame these. So can I just can I infinitely fly in this level? Okay, this is cool. So I've got to get all the chests within the time, I guess. Time up. Okay, I failed. Right, so I need to get all the chests, the arches, the rings, and the lights in one try. Okay, let's uh go again. going. So far so good, I ain't missed anything yet. Alright, I think the 
should be the run, assuming I don't miss a, a light. The light's definitely the most awkward find, at least. All right, that's the last one. I got five seconds. I think we got it. Yeah, nice. There we go. All right, so I think I'm completely done in this area, so we're going to move to the next world. All right, off to Magic Crafters. Oh no, it knocked me off. Got a trophy though. Pops off the tops. Detonate three explosive chests on the pillars in Alpine Ridge. Gonna have to time this. There we go. Beautiful. That might be the last one as well for 100%. Yeah, there we go. Got all the dragons. Got 500 gems, which means 100% level completion. Charge, boy. Suckers. What is she doing up here? No? Alright. Wait, what's this? Oh, she give me, like, extra power or something to, to kill these? Oh, nice. Okay, beautiful. That was helpful. Arachnophobe. Beat all of the metal back spiders. Right, so we need to get across there. We're going to have to use the ramp. And then there's also an area over here as well. But we're going to have to ramp up. So, let's go get some speed. See if we can do these ramps. Try this one first. There we go. Beautiful stuff. Oh, there's another egg guy over here. There's two in this level. Around the back. Nice. Egg hunt trophy let's go defeat hidden egg thief in a wizard peak right so now i just need to do the other ramp as well oh there that guy is an enemy and a chest so how do we get up to that guy maybe another sprint situation maybe yeah maybe if i use this sprint i could jump high enough to to get up there maybe let's try Oh, close. Maybe I could actually make that. I don't know. It's got to be... Yeah, I feel like it's probably got to be that because there's not really any other way to get up there. Not that I can see. Maybe I've just got to jump earlier or something. Right, let's try again. Super, super close. You must be able to make that. Maybe if I, like, went up this little ramp part here. Dude, if that's the way you're supposed to do it, that's a super tight jump. I don't know if I'm doing it right. I don't know if that's what I'm supposed to be doing. I feel like that's the only way I can get up there, but I'm just slightly too low. That's why I feel like maybe that that slight little ramp in the middle could maybe get me to pull it off, but I still can't seem to seem to make the jump. Oh, I made it! Oh no! And that no! <laughs> oh no! I finally made it and then jumped off the other side. God damn, that's annoying. At least now I know how to do it. So that was how we get up there. So now I need to get back up there again, but without falling off the other side so I can get the two chests. And then that should, that should get me 100%. Now I've got to do this bloody jump again. It took me like, I don't know, six tries to get up there the first time. So hopefully I can maybe get it in like, no, no. Ooh, ooh, that was so close. I almost fell off. Right, are we good? Yeah, there we go. That's all 500. So 100% level complete in Wizard Peak. You can actually burn the... Oh, wait, hold up. There's a trophy for that. Hot Wings 2. Flame all fairies in crystal flight. Oh, I was just kind of messing around with flaming them. Wait, so if that's number two, that means there might have been... There's probably another one of these trophies on one of the other flight levels. I can't remember the name of it, but there was definitely another flying level. So I'll have to probably go back at some point and grab that one. Right, ring's done. Gate's done. Go. Planes again. Last plane. Right, now let's grab these chests. 
try not to buff it up. And we should be should be good. Alright, three more, two more. Last one, and we still got eight seconds. Beautiful. That was pretty easy actually. It's more about just knowing which route to take, I think, with those. So level complete, 100 percent on crystal flight. Rude. So I think now I'm done in this area. I think I've done all the levels. Uh, I've got 100% in all the ones I've done at least. So I think we're probably good now to move on to the next world. So we're going to move on to the Beast Maker's world. Let's go. Yeah, that's definitely the way we get up there. Look around here though, make sure there's nothing else we're missing. Get yeah. Oh, Mushroom Hunter. Flame 5 glowing mushrooms in beast makers sweet so yeah beast makers is a new world area we're in it's another trophy for the collection oh no poor chicken you're free now oh cage free free a trapped chicken <laughs> sweet sorry now i'm gonna burn you <laughs> all right got all the boats Alright, got all of them. So I need the planes and the chests. Go. Planes. So, how many do I need? Four more. Three more. Alright, might be okay here. Grab that one. Right, I need one more, but I don't know where it is. There it is. Come on, get him. Beautiful, there we go. Oh, trophy for this one as well. I believe it is time for me to fly. Complete wild flight without touching the ground. Oh, nice, so trophy and 100% complete on another level. All right, speed down here. At the end of the ramp. Smash that, beautiful. We got another ramp here. Speed down this. Oh, trophy. Launch date. Jump off every supercharged ramp in treetops. All right, so I'm not even going to lie to you, champs. I've had to look at a guide for the second time because I couldn't figure out how to get this one over here. Could not figure this one out, so I had to look at a guide on how to do it. And then the other area I couldn't figure out how to get to was at the exit, the, the area at the top. I couldn't figure out how to get to there, but now I can go over to that other area and hopefully that'll be the final few gems that I need. All right, so the next one we need to do is we need to run down here, speed round. Then instead of going over there, we need to go over this way. We need to get around this without messing it up jump over there which gets us onto the second boost which pushes us all the way up on top of here and this should hopefully now be my final few gems to get 100 percent in this area yep there it is that's our 500 gems 100 percent level complete on treetops oh we got boss hey, what up bud so what i have to do get him to roll yeah, I think I gotta get him to roll his little buddies. To destroy these power cores. Alright, well, it's working so far, if that is what we're meant to be doing. Can I, like, shock them or anything? No. Gonna roll that guy into it. There we go. Right, last one. And then I'd imagine maybe that beam will hit him or we can shoot him or something. Oh, he's running off. Oh, he's. Hold on, sprint, mate. He's gone. He's out of here. Nice. We got him. Sucker. Alright, so... If I remember right, the chest was up here. Hopefully then this will give me my final 25 gems. If not, I must have missed one somewhere, but we'll see. I feel like that's probably give all of them to me. We're missing one gem. Bruh. Wait. Oh, it was behind me. <laughs> Trophy as well. Gems in the rough. Collect 500 gems in metal head. Nice. I don't think I've actually had a trophy before for grabbing all the gems in a level. But there it is. Alright, this should be the 
final few that I need now. Get a kiss from the fairy. Get my power. And then I should be able to take out the remaining enemies. Wait, am I like... Do I get to keep this forever now then? Usually you get like a little meter, don't you? A timer that how long you can stay in this farm, but I don't have it this time. So do I just get to keep it? I guess so. Bro, stop. <laughs> hey, I got a trophy. Scrap metal. Defeat all tin soldiers. Ooh, another trophy. That <laughs> bad dog is. Defeat three demon dogs in large form. Pop his balloon. <laughs> Bye. Oh, this is where the rest of the chests are. I couldn't find the... Where the hell the remaining chests were. That's probably... Oh! Fly like an eagle. I thought I was, I didn't think I were done. Complete icy flight without touching the ground. Another one of those touching the ground trophies. Jacko's, Jacko Tacula? I'm not sure how you say that, but defeat four nightmare beasts in one glide. All right, so I believe we're now also well done, done with this you know world. It means we can go to Nasty's world. Okay, yes. So this might be... I'm guessing this is probably the final world. Pretty sure Nasty's the guy we're, uh, we've been, you know, trying to get to. All right, well, here we are. Nasty's world does look pretty nasty. So, yeah, I think this is probably the final world because if you look at our game total completion, we're on 85%. I've only been playing for five hours, which means this is a super, super short platinum. Um, I've got 12 eggs, 74 dragons, and we obviously need the 12,000 gems. So I'm getting pretty close. I need another, what, 1,800. So we're almost there. What up, Nock? Oh shit, you're just gonna attack me right out the gate? Okay. Right, hold on, brother. I've got gems to grab. Ow. Rude, bro. I'm trying to grab gems. Oh, there's one of those freaking teasing dudes as well with the, uh. Yo, can I have the key, please? Yo, I need that key. Where are you? Oh, he's gonna have to be running around in circles as usual. Hell nah, bro. Come here, you little shit. Come here. Oh, you. Quick, bro. Gotcha, you little turd. Give me my damn key. Guess it's for this. Nice. Bro, another one? Is this level just taking the piss? What up, bro? You still running off? Really? Wait. Is it is is this guy sending me in circles now as well? Dude, are you freaking kidding me, bro? Even the final boss is having me run around in circles? Bro, this is a troll. What a troll. <laughs> I wonder if I'm maybe supposed to go backwards around the level instead of forwards potentially to catch him because I think I remember when I was looking at how many trophies I needed. I think I remember there was a trophy for getting this guy to do five laps or at least just as I was saying it. There we go. Dragon on and on. Get a nasty knock to complete five laps. That was the one. I remember reading it like vaguely. Get out of here, buddy. Did we get him? Oh, damn. Nice. Get out of here, not. Did we get him? Oh, I think we did it. I think we completed the game. I'm not sure if we got 100% on that level there. I'm, I could have swore it popped up for like a split second saying we did. All right, so he said we've still got treasure to find. So yeah, I guess there's one more, that one more level at the end might be like a special level. There it is though, Spyro Reignited Trilogy. So that's the first Spyro game beat. But of course we've got more to do. So that one didn't open up yet. So I'm not sure how we opened that one. We'll figure it out. Yeah, I beat the main game. Still got a few more trophies to earn though. Yeah, still got another, yeah, another 11 trophies to earn before unlocking the platinum. Doing really good percent wise though. I only need 300 of those. One more dragon, which is right in front of me. We're on 96%. And then I'd imagine the rest of it's just going to be 
like random things during levels that we didn't complete. The, the, it sounds ridiculous, but do you know what the most difficult thing is about this game? That I expect Spyro to sprint in the direction of the camera and he doesn't, he sprints in the direction he's facing. So for example, my brain tells me now, if I press square, he'll sprint towards the door, but he'll sprint where he's looking. That's the hardest thing about this game for me. It made me fail jumps way too many times. Reached 100%. I need 100%. Okay, well, I've got all dragons, and I've now got 100% in this area. So what am I missing? I'm missing 300. I'm not sure what it is I'm missing. Maybe there's like a level in one of the areas that I've somehow missed. I think it might be, actually. If you look, Dreamweavers, I've, there's six, 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 five. So maybe I missed one level in the very first area, potentially. Oh my God, right, I just looked online. There's a level here. I was jumping on these, but for some reason, I just didn't think to jump on them all. You jump on all of these, it opens up a level. Sunny Flight. This is the one level I was missing. This should have my final 300 gems. Oh, I got 300, nice. Right, so now we've got all the gems, which means I should be able to head back over to the final world and complete that final bonus level. Oh, trophy, I weren't even expecting that. I'm in the money. Unlock Nasty's loot. Sweet, there it is. There's Nasty's loot. Oh, is this his, is this his loot? Now there's a lot of gems. Oh my lord. Has he got loads of love letters? What the hell's going on? What is this place, bro? Hey, there we go. That's all 2,000 in this level and trophy hoarder. Collect all gems in Nasty's loot. All right, well, that's 120% complete. 100% in every single level. Got all the loot, got all the gems, got all the dinosaurs, got everything. So anything I'm missing now, which is another nine trophies, are all going to be miscellaneous trophies in certain levels. So let's go get them. All right. So the first trophy I'm going to get is a super easy one. I just need to basically do a loop around an arch. So if I press that and go around like this, there we go. Press R1, ban Stormer. Do a loop around an arch. This next one I'm going to grab is in the Peacekeeper hub. It's another super easy one. So I just basically need to use a cannon to take out one of these dudes while they're taunting. So if I do this, you'll moony me. And then I can do that and take him out. There we go. Easy peasy. Shoot the moon. Use a cannon to dispatch a taunting knot. Okay, so next one. If you remember a while back, I did one of these flying levels and I got a trophy for flaming the these, the little fairies. So I need to do the same in this level, which is the, the night flight level. So I've got one of them. I think there's only two. So that's one. I need to find the second one. There we go. Unless there's more than two, maybe. I'm not sure. All right, there must be maybe more than two in this level because I think the other level only had two of them. I'm having trouble finding this third one. Oh, this is the last one. Unless there's more than three. Yeah, there we go. Hot Wings 1. Flame all of the fairies in night flight. So I've entered the magic crafter's world because I need to charge four enemies in a row these dudes here there's four there so let's line it up one two three four there it is coming through charge through four armored druids near the start of magic crafters all right so this next trophy is called rocketeer i'm in the level like terence village so i've got a light three rockets within 15 seconds so i got one there one there and one down there so like that one like that one and that one and that should hopefully give us the trophy that was super delayed i thought i did it too slow or something there it is Rocketeer, like three fireworks within 15 seconds. Another super, super easy trophy. I just need to charge three of those in a row. So I wait for him to go small, charge through. There we go. Three in a row, just like that. And there it is. Fool's errand, charge through three armored fools 
in a row, similar to the one we just did. We need to charge four of those like puffer birds in a row. So let's roll. One, two, three, four. And that should be the ding ding, all puffed up. All right, so I'm here in the level Twilight Harbor. We only need two more trophies now before the platinum. For this one, you just saw there, I destroyed a, um, like a gear. We need to destroy all six of those gears in this level. So that was the first one. The second one is there. So that's number two. That's number three. Kind of hard to see that one in the corner there, but that's three. And we've got number four in this room, but I'm going to try and get rid of the enemies first. There we go. So there's number four. Five is pretty close. Just around the corner. There's five, so we need one more. Get rid of all these guys. Get out of the way, fellas. There we go. And then the last one should be just on this corner. There it is. That should be all six. What really grinds my gears? Destroy six gears in Twilight Harbor. One more trophy, and the platinum is mine. All right, so this final trophy is another really easy one. Super simple. I'm in the level Nork Cove. I basically just need to do this level without killing any of the rats that are scattered around. I'll do my best not to ram into any or burn any. Gotta look out for explosions though, because we could kill one by mistake with like an explosion like that. So we do have to be really careful. I don't think there's actually any way of knowing if you killed one or not. I, I don't know. There's no like indicator. So just gotta hope that when I get to the end, the trophy will pop. And it'll give a, give us a new shiny platinum. Our first Spyro platinum. It says the end of the level. There, there it is. Raptastic. Complete knock cove without killing any rats, which means the platinum is ours. Nasty's demise, that is collect all Spyro the Dragon trophies. Hell yeah, really enjoyed this. Super easy, super fun, really short as well. I've only put in six hours and seven minutes. So yeah, super, super short, but a lot of fun. Either way though, thank you all so much for watching. Consider subscribing for Spyro 2. I've been Mr. Leaning, take care and I'll catch you all on the next video.